This week we're doing something a little bit different. We're trading in the ball cap for the big cowboy hats and we're going out to Rock Springs, Wyoming and take a look at the National High School Finals Rodeo. We're gonna be meeting up with our good buddy from Weatherby, Mike Schwiebert. And Weatherby, as well as the NRA, is a big sponsor of the National Finals event. There's Mr. Mike. Glad you found us. How's it going, man? Good to see you. Oh, man. Great to see you. Hey, Jesse, how are you? Good, good to see you. We get there and find out that this is the biggest rodeo in the world. We've got high school kids from every state in the nation, yeah. from Canada and Australia, that come here to compete. So it's really an international event. Now, Mike has a long history of being involved in rodeo. I've been involved in rodeo and bull riding for uh, much of my professional life. And so it was a real natural segue for the company to get involved in the National High School Rodeo Association Scholarship Fund. Weatherby sponsors this event. Yeah, we've been national sponsors since 2001. Uh, we think it's just a great, great thing to support, you know, the grassroots and heartland of our country. The rodeo doesn't start until later tonight, but the NRA has a National High School Trap Shooting Championship, and it's going on right now, so we hurry up there and get a chance to see some of the kids competing. Well, we're out here at the Sweetwater Trap Club, and we're with Dave Manzer, who is the field rep for the Friends of NRA here in Wyoming. Yes. Tell us what we got going on out here. NRA and National High School Rodeo teamed up about seven years ago and, and had this event and it has grown extensively since that first year and it's, it is unique to the National High School Rodeo. And you've got a great facility here to, for the kids to shoot. It is, yes. A lot of the money that's raised in the Friends of NRA program here in the state, does it have anything to do with this NRA event here or just more toward the facility? Uh, more towards the facility on this, but there's kids that participate in rodeo that we have affected through the shooting sports as they've grown up also. So our money has affected many kids in Wyoming and across the country also. Looks like traps going on behind us. Let's go take a look. All right. Sounds good. Okay. This Sweetwater Trap Club, um, it, it was here before the Friends of the NRA, obviously. Um, but they came down and, and uh, applied for the grant for the machinery that's here. Today being up here is kind of giving me a little sense of pride that I was involved with it because these machines that they're using, we helped provide for them. While we were out at the range, we also got to meet up with Britt and Josh, uh, some kids that were at the shotgun championship, but also entered in the rodeo as well. So you're in the top four in the... Uh... Team roping, calf roping, and steer wrestling. Yes. Wow, three of them. Okay. So and you do more events than just the bull and bronc riding, right? Yes, ma'am. You do everything you said, right? Everything but the bareback riding. Oh, okay. Yeah. But you're qualified for the national finals for sow bronc and, and bull riding. Okay. If you do well in the shotgun portion, you get some money for scholarship. Yes, sir. So you could actually okay. double up as well in the yeah. rodeo portion, too. Yep. The kids are actually shooting for college scholarship funds. So some are pulling double duty, shooting and rodeoing, and some are just strictly here for the shooting.